Have you ever had these two wishes? Seeing through things and becoming invisible? By putting my hand over the light, the light goes through my thumb, giving it this red color. It's a bit like taking an x-ray. X-rays are powerful waves of energy. Like light, x-rays are a form of irradiation. They are very useful because they can go through substances that light cannot. X-rays can show images or pictures of the inside of an object, such as a suitcase or the human body. To produce an X-ray picture, an X-ray machine produces a very concentrated beam of electrons known as X-ray photons. This beam travels through the air, comes into contact with our body tissues, and produces an image on a metal film. Okay, so now we're gonna do the experience. And so, I've just put on my glove because it can get really, really sticky. So, you see this ball. There's nothing in it, right? Well. Oh, and there's something else. Something else? And something else? And I can see something. And look. Another piece. Uh, oh my goodness. And another one. Okay, so now I think uh, I pushed everything out. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to re-show you. So, just look. We put the... So, the, there's a simple explanation, and it's not magic, it's science. Okay, in water, um, the light changes direction, so you can see what's uh, in it. And this ball is not water, it's glycerin, and so the light passes through, and so in making you unable to see what's inside. So, for this experience, you just need a bowl of of a uh, of, uh, pyrex um, with glycerin, and glycerin you can usually find it at a pharmacy. And so then you have little things like this. Now, if you can see like this. So, and this also needs to be in perks, preferably. And so then you just put them in it and it disappears completely. 
So. So yeah, you can't see anything, right? So make this trick to your family and friends. I really hope they appreciate it. So yeah. Okay, so now I've added some pink food coloring. And so it works just the same. I'll show you. So do you see anything? No, no, no. Okay. So one, two, three. Four, five, and six.